been living with us. Um, we met when my parents divorced. They may sound American, but they're English and Irish. What makes Elvis Dumbledore so fond of you? Because acting American is one of the key skills Hollywood stars are now being asked to do. But pulling off a convincing accent doesn't always work out. Well-known actor Dick Van Dyke last month apologised for what he called the most atrocious Cockney accent in the history of cinema as the chimney sweep in the 1964 movie Mary Poppins. Mary Poppins, you look beautiful. Maybe they've made Tinseltown their home. Maybe they even have a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. But most actors need a little bit of extra help. And that means there's a new boom in Hollywood. <laughs> there's an increasing demand for dialect coaches, people like Gabby Santinelli. And that's because of actors like Darren. He's British, but many of his roles in Hollywood require an American accent. I am calm. Open it. He's been in popular US shows from Two Broke Girls to True Blood, and mastering the American accent was make or break for his career in Hollywood. If I'm going in for an American role, I know that I'm competing against all the Americans. So you've got to be as good as them and now the accent. And if you can't do one of those things, then you don't really have a chance. As an actor, the ultimate goal is for the audience to not really realize because then we're doing our job. It's just going to be that bursting, full fat vowel. I'm personally seeing a steady stream of actors asking for who can help me with my accent. And I'm sure that other dialect coaches are feeling that as well because as people are getting off flights at LAX and saying, oh, uh, I got my car, I got my visa, I got my apartment, I got my agent, I got my photos. Suddenly, they're like, oh, but I have to speak a different way. And speaking in that different way isn't easy. At least, not without sounding cheesy. Let's try... Put the Parmesan cheese in my palm. Put the Parmesan cheese in my palm. Yeah, Parmesan cheese. Parmesan. Yeah. So when you actually give yourself a little more time, you can cover all the bases. Because in England, we'd say Parmesan. Parmesan. I mean, the whole word changes. So what feels like too much to you and like this big R uh, feels right to me. And that's where my job is to assure someone that, that they have to go for it and they have to commit to it. Googa, giga, gaga, gaga, goga. Coaching can cost thousands of dollars over the course of an actor's career, but if they land more roles, they know that investment will be worth it. Francis Reed, CGTN in Los Angeles.